Hello, in this video we're going to go over the process on how to collect uh, topographic data, how to measure topo. So here's our main general survey screen. Um, the function we want to use is measure and then measure topo brings us to this screen. So this point name just continues where we left off. If you remember in the previous videos I've keyed in, um, basically I have points keyed in one through four so I'm going to carry on. In this case, I'm actually going to jump to um, 5,000. This is the point range I want to use to collect topographic data. And then um, code, I'm going to collect a curb shot. So CRB is the description code that I choose to use. Uh, angles and distances is what I want to measure. And target height of, uh, of 5 feet, in my case, is correct. So double check these uh, values for your instrument. Your, your station setup should be complete and you have an instrument height of 5 feet and then these are um, your options for your target. So target 1 is going to be a prism rod. Target DR is going to be direct reflex. That's what I'm using in my case but make sure that if you're using your rod make sure that your height's correct and your prism offset. Um, but again I'm using 5 feet so uh, once I'm aimed at the object I want to measure, which I'm aimed at my curb, I want to select measure. You can see the instruments measuring. And here are the results. So you have the results of horizontal angle, vertical angle, and slope distance to the point. Um, if, if you're happy with these results, you can store. And then if you want to take another shot at another um, curb, Go ahead and hit measure. Brings up the results to this point. Again, I'm happy with these results, so I'm going to store it. Now, every time you change to a new object, you want to change your uh, description key. So I want to do a tree deciduous. That's TRD. And then, um, as you can see, my point numbers are advancing. I go ahead and measure to that point. And I'll go ahead and store it. So that's the process to measure topo. Um, again, when you're completed, um, a good idea is to go ahead and check your backside. We'll go through that in the next video. Thanks.